Hey, what's going on guys? It is Seth here with the Cruising Classics YouTube channel showcasing this 1969 Chevrolet Camaro RS SS. Right off the bat, I just want to say if you guys have any questions about this car, financing, shipping, whatever the case may be, feel free to give us a phone call at 614-276-7355. I do apologize for any wind noise in the background. You can see it's an overcast day here in Columbus, Ohio, where we're located. So please bear with me. But this is a real X22 code car. It's all correct to the trim code there on the cow. Or firewall rather. Beautiful car, Justin Hugger orange, black vinyl top, 14 inch SS wheels, BF Goodrich radial tires. Fit and finish on this car is excellent. It was just a completed frame off restoration less than a month or so ago. You can see her black tail there. This is a 396 car, four speed Muncie, center console, wood grain trim. Checks all the boxes, guys. It's a beautiful car. Happy to film it. I mean, just look how glossy this car is. Hideaway headlights. You can see when I look down the side of this car how straight it is. Let's go ahead and check out the inside. Does have standard vinyl black interior. Beautiful door jams. Under the door is in excellent shape as to be expected. Pretty much everything on this car is new. Dash pad's in excellent shape. Headliner is awesome. Working dome light. Let me just look at that door jam. Again, I do apologize for any wind noise in the background. It's an extremely windy day here. But you'll see your center console here. Her shifter assembly. Factory center console gauges. smells brand new in here as to be expected you have a little photo album there of the car all the way down to the metal to paint and body interior everything's in that little photo album All the bright work on this car is show quality, show quality paint, glass is in excellent shape, all that is all new. See the underside of the trunk here is painted to match. See your quarter panels look great. Even your taillight assemblies trunk pan, spare tire and jack assemblies there. Just a beautiful car guys. Again you can see your vinyl top was installed correctly. Just looking at the trim on this car. does have a black hockey stripe running down the side as well. Let's go and check out this door panel. If you're just watching the video, you haven't seen all 70 plus photos of this car, be sure to visit the link in the description or go to our website. You can see that in the bottom right hand corner of the screen cruising classics inc.com even little details like your center console light is working if you can see the shadow there
It does have a factory tachometer. Again, wood grain trim throughout the car. Let's go ahead and grab our key here. It does have a working reverse lockout as well. Go ahead and set our e-brake. You can see the brake light comes on. Go ahead and turn on our headlights, which the hideaway headlights are still vacuum assisted. Fuel gauge, oil pressure, coolant temp, and battery light all are working down there. Radio does light up, does not have sound out of it. Not sure if they just didn't put speakers back in, whatever the case may be, but if you're concerned about that, there's your answer. Great sound out of this 396 though. Very throttle responsive. Also, if you guys heard it, uh, when I had the key in the ignition, the door buzzer was working as well. Odometer shows 35,000, 193 miles on it. Gonna check our wipers. Those are working. Just a beautiful car, guys. Reverse lights do work as well. You can see your running lights are working. Corner marker light is working there. You see your headlights are opened up. Running lights and headlights are on. Let's go ahead and check out under the hood. Alrighty guys, here's an under hood shot of the X22 car. I will go ahead and display a photo on the screen of the cow tag there. But you can see this engine bay is nice and tidy. Engine has been repainted. Even has the correct dealer inspection markings, all the correct stamping on your hoses, correct battery clamps, you got your T-style clamps. Everything is correct under the hood as it should be and it looks great. Alrighty guys, let's go ahead and take this thing on a drive. We'll see how she does. Alrighty guys, you can see we're rowing some gears. We're gonna be taking this X22 code car on a short drive. And boy, does it sound good. Honestly, this is probably the best shifting first gen Camaro I've driven with a Muncie four speed in it. Obviously I've driven some Tremec five speed cars, um, but this one shifts excellent. I mean, it's super notchy, very smooth as well. You, you know when it's in gear or out of gear, if you can understand that. But we're cruising 50, just over 2000 RPM. Cars riding excellent to be expected with how well restored this car is. You can see our indicator is working down there on the dashboard as it should be. Just a very nice car. Really good sound out of the exhaust. But if you guys are interested in this Camaro, feel free to give us a call at 614-276-7355. We can discuss shipping, financing, whatever the case may be with you guys. I know I'd love to have this car in my garage, collection, whatever you guys have. I mean, we'll hook you up. We'll go ahead and throw a left indicator on here again. We'll make a uh, U-turn. We'll head back towards the showroom.
we're sitting about 40 pounds of oil pressure. Coolant temperature is not even at half yet. This thing runs nice and cool. It's very quiet in this car as well. I'm sure they use plenty of sound deadening when they put this car back together because it's nice and tight and sealed in here and you can tell there's no loose seals up here, no loose seals on the passenger side. It closes up great. Love the sound too. I know I've said it four times, but <laughs> it really is a really good sounding car. It's just got that old school rasp to it. But again, guys, if you're interested in this car, don't hesitate to call and ask any questions. Our friendly staff will be happy to help you out. Maybe myself will answer the phone, just depends. But if you guys stay tuned toward the end of the video, you guys will see pictures underneath of this car and it's excellent. It looks amazing underneath. The underneath matches the outside. And unfortunately, we just had a semi truck pull right out in front of us. I was gonna go to second, but it's too short of a gear. But anyway, guys, if you did enjoy the video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, press the subscribe button. Helps you get notified every time we list a car for sale. Helps us sell more cars as well. Thanks so much for watching, guys. As always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.